Good evening, everyone. I go by the name of Togozile Tuketi, and um, this is my entrepreneurial challenge vlog. So before I already knew what I was going to sell, I already knew that my target market would be students because, I mean, we interact with each other on a daily basis as students. So I sat down and thought about like how students would like like a snack that they would eat when they are studying or during their study breaks and like the idea of making popcorn came to my mind because that's one kind of snack that they can have which they can flavor it their own way so like some can decide to put salt or put their own flavor spice it up the way they want to so i decided to sell popcorn um for five friend per bow uh, as i've said that i've decided to sell popcorn and these are the two key ingredients that i'm going to use to make popcorn so now i'm done making my first batch of popcorns i still need to make three or four more batches because these won't be enough so when i was already planning about how i would accomplish my plan i already knew that i would sell popcorns to students so the skills that i thought about which i knew that would add value were my networking skills because i know that like I'm, i have the ability to be able to talk to people and start conversations and i knew that would make it i knew that that would make it easy for me to be able to get people who would buy from me and I also used self-motivation because it's important that I keep myself motivated. Thank you. The challenges that I faced while striving to accomplish my goal was that um, there was a lack of support from some people. So some people were really not interested in what I had to offer or what I was selling them. But then I knew that I had to keep going and I knew I had to stay motivated. I utilized um, me staying on campus as an opportunity because um, I was able to sell popcorn to people, to some of my restmates at night or during study breaks without feeling unsafe because I knew that I was still within the premises of where I live and I was able to sell to a lot of students that live um in the same premises as i do so me staying on campus was a huge opportunity i used an article from forbes as a source of information because i needed to find out which other essential skills do i need to have as an entrepreneur so that article was about essential skills that every entrepreneur needs to have so we've come to the end of my video. Thank you for watching my vlog. I really hope you enjoyed it. Bye!